Hi, this is Norcafine and welcome back to the Crusader Kings 2 Norse Conquest series. Where I will try to conquer the whole of Scandinavia and Norsify the north. Uh, last episode we kept earning us some cash. We raided the Pope, as you can see. <laughs> All his stuff is now torn down to the ground, as it should be, and now we have to plan ahead on how we are going to subjugate or conquer all of this. So, we uh, really can't do anything about uh, this yet, unless we have, uh, uh, unless we get claims. I want to take everything in one fell swoop. Uh, why can't I see your... Yeah, um... So we should want some uh, claimants. Invite somebody who is... Uh, what, should, what should I call it? Um... Yeah, claimant to this kingdom because I really want to take them. But that is not possible just yet. And we don't have any castle spellies on them. So, what I will probably end up doing is to conquer these weak ones down here. So, we. Yeah, let's get to it. Uh, I have a rather large retinue. So, we can go do some raiding to really earn ourselves some cash. We still have a truce to the, until next year with this guy. So we can't really do anything about that. Um, since we have a holding over here, we should really u utilize that. However, it's not my goal, so I think I will leave the English part of our kingdom for the moment and uh, concentrate my my, my, my uh, efforts uh, in the sure Denmark. So we start by raiding some locations of the East Frankians, and uh, for some reason, this guy is imprisoned by Louis the Quarreler. So he's at war, or was at war, and they. Uh, yeah, there they raised some of their levy, so they will come and try to kill us soon. Yeah, there they come. Uh, yeah, we are not going to win that fight. But we managed to raise uh, the, uh, what's it called? Uh, the temple, giving us an extra moral authority. Infidel temples looted. So yeah, that's very nice. So, um, yeah, what you really want to do is to raid and uh, gain stuff, cash, that is. What I really want to do is to take these guys, just conquer everyone. So I may want to try to fabricate a claim on Agdir, and then we gain the conquest castle spell on these single counter guys so we can speed up the conquest yes for some reason he's getting the honest trait yeah we really want to get some elective monarchy up and running but yeah um so we will be upgrading our personal holding Maybe by keep and uh, see to do some war. I really want to. Oh, he of course took that. So I will now go to war on him and take it from him. So just and raise those guys. 
since he just conquered that he is going to have yeah so a weaker levy so it's a prime time and this will also give us borders to uh, will we have a border with this guy <coughs> so we may want to go in and take this single county guys in a conquest war not a holy oh we can't do holy wars yet and uh, it would be really cool to take this guy as well however i think the carolingians will carolingians rather will come and reclaim that area because it's their de jure territory so i won't uh, throw away time and units on that but uh, our friend over here is in some sort of war with Dorset so I will just help him send the troops there and we will yeah just keep on oh she's a quick one Nice. But we will keep uh, sieging, claiming territory. And, um, yeah. This is just how it's going to go. Waiting for something exciting to happen. So we have soon all of this uh, for some reason this guy is also at war uh, attacking subjugation okay so we don't really want him to subjugate anything so we may want to go in there and kill off this guy gain some war score thank you and yeah we, we won so now we have borders with these guys, and that is not really a sure uh, kingdom of uh, Germans, so we shouldn't have any problem uh, for the moment. So I will expand these guys. Maybe, yeah. Um, or sieging down this, so he won. So now he has all this. Might happen that we end up coming into a conflict with our ally over here. I really hope that won't happen. But in any case, we will now just go to a conquest extravaganza. We erase everybody. And uh, yeah, maybe not. Um, I will bother to grab those guys. And uh, bring them over to help. But yeah, that's probably enough. Yeah, we really crush those guys. So, it'll take some time probably. I uh, again, yeah, he turned into a king, so that's a bit of a problem, maybe. We can't really vassalize that guy, we just lack some power for the opinion. But we will just endure. Some more troops. Uh, spy master, I will send him to spread the attack in Constantinople. And uh, yeah, what's that guy for? So, uh, yeah, we will maybe have to send off some guys to scare that guy off. Just to get those 59 guys over here. Which is good. Just to send those boats that came to see for. Well, well, it's going to be an intriguing one. Which may not be the best, but I don't really care. So, uh, yeah. 
person sieging down the top holdings here. We will uh, maybe pull the barracks. We will probably be able to piece out this guy. And my son came of age, scholarly theologian. Very nice. I will find him a. Ooh, this is a very nice role. Loads of stewardship. However, she has a genius trait, which may be more interesting. But yeah, um, I went a little bit off there just to marry some of my kids away. And uh, yeah, uh, hopefully, we will gain some nice traits into our dynasty. Genius trait. It's very cool, very handy to have. And we have a um, prisoner, yeah. So, our first one is now conquered. And uh, just remember to grant those things away. And now, we just have to conquer this guy. And then we will go here. Uh, this is the county which will spawn a castle and the Yums Vikings, which would be really cool to have now, because they are the only holy order for the Norse. So if we will have them on our side, we will be really well off against the Christians. And we gain another province. Can we? Yeah, we can't really do anything with that, so... Well, we will want to do something about this. Uh, legalism, siege equipment, light infantry, construction, cost infrastructure, yeah. Those kinds of stuff. So, uh, next on our list will be Irana and Dolomichi. Dolomichi. Maybe we could take this. Troops, yeah, you really don't have anything. No allies, so, so you will be a right for the picking. 500 troops, not really much to brag about. Let me do this last time. Gather my troops. And we will be sending these guys to take that. And the next bunch will be used to take Brennerberg. The nice thing about the Norse faith is that you can also navigate rivers with your boats. So we can deploy troops inside the country. Another son of age, indulgent wastrel. So he had a really bad education. He's a really bad dude after all, all, all overall. So Split this in half, send half over there, half over there, the rest will go there. And send the bonus back to. I lost my ambitious trait. Damn. It's a nice trait to have, gives you some uh, attribute points to play around with, but we will have to do without. And again, it's just all about the sieging. You should not... Ah, uh, he became gluttonous. Damn boy. <clears throat> so, we can marry him off to a pregnant one, making that child of our dynasty, I think. Uh, but I don't want to do that. I will try to find someone with a trait like genius. And, uh, or maybe that was the guy. No, it was this guy, so, again, uh, quick is okay, but I will want to find genius, or strong maybe, just to get some of that gene flowing in our family, some attractive ones, did I have a genius over here? No. I think I will go for that strong one I saw around here somewhere. Uh, 
Well, is there no strong... There really she is. So she's 5 and he's 4, so that's a really nice match. Yeah, uh, first... Hold the fold, which is great. We have the holdings, which we don't need. Or we don't want to hold. Um, yeah, when we take this, we can make a duchy. This is part of the Duchy of Saxony, so we may have a problem with this guy. Which will try to probably take it as it is his de sure uh, holding. Yeah, why not? Uh, he's going into here. Yeah. Uh, the Norse guy is gone. He probably got ex uh, killed, uh, or he converted, which is not that typical to see, actually. But uh, woo on him, we won't end up like that idiot, we will stay true Norse. And that guy just uh, gave up. Um, this, uh, holding to us, which is cool, nice, nice, um, I will, again, grant some stuff to people in my court, um, of course my sons are doing better than these idiots, so maybe what I will do is give one of my sons, uh, these two are really great, that one is very great, but I will make him into the count of Altmark, no, um, Unhooked. Why not? And you, well, I think I have a holding over here. But I will try to keep that because it gives me some. Uh, should I call it troops? But yeah, uh, for now we can just keep everything else because we are under our demand limit. So there's no need to get panicked about that. Somebody is dying, people are dying, um, we have some prisoners, we will just ransom those, kill you, and kill you, and yeah, we have loads of troops, but that's because this is, uh, we have so many holdings, uh, and yeah, you gave me holding, yeah, I'm a real snake in the eye, am I not, a deceitful asshole taking your stuff but life is life so we can create the duchy of Mecklenburg and the duchy of Brandenburg so this one I will be granting to maybe one of my sons actually but yeah yeah, I think for the moment I really don't have any great vassals, so I will make this this good guy into that count, and I will just keep these holdings, uh, Brandenburg Duchy for now. But yeah, we will not go and temple her. Uh, can't really murder you, and we can't. Oh, we can almost, but I don't want to do it, or I don't see any reason to. So, um, now we just have to raid for the time being. And, uh, yeah, we have grown substantially. We started off uh, over here, and we have taken five new holdings. Which is very nice. Our power is growing substantially. And uh, soon I will try to find a way to just claim these guys because I don't really care about this. I want this. And really, there's no claimants to this, so I can't really go to war over that. It doesn't really make any sense. But also, what we really want is to reform the faith. So we have enough moral authority, but we don't have the control over the Dishur. No, no, not the Dishur. Uh, the holy sites, which is here and here. So we 
have to find a way to get into those. So, in any case, while reading this, maybe we should uh, indeed go and just take some of this land. Or maybe not. Uh, or maybe this guy. Uh, we may be fast enough to avoid inciting the wrath of Frankia, because I really don't want to have this asshole charging in my, on my business. So yeah, maybe I will do that. Uh, <coughs> just to have more land, basically. We can go to war on... No, we can't. Why? Uh, oh yeah, we can conquer uh, coastal provinces because or uh, neighboring provinces. And uh, he won. To Rene. So maybe he will conquer more. Who knows? But yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, we'll just. Not raid. I think we will just take our men back home, and uh, we can raise four thousand plus that. So we have five thousand five hundred. So we will do just this. We will declare war. And in seeing that, I just remembered why um, uh, we really don't. Uh, we have to wait a fucking long time because we will have a truce with these idiots so maybe I will re, 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 re I will re rethink my ID but yes so um a bit cutting and jumping and uh, wobbling but uh yeah I think I will be going to raid why not I was Toying with the idea of conquering Rome just for the fun of it, uh, but then probably Italy will just conquer it back. So uh, we will uh, visit the Pope one more time just to remind him what a big asshole we are. Take his money again. Why not? He is one of the his he and Venice is one of the richest single my uh, promises. So raiding their stuff will be uh, loving us uh, to raid without uh, him being able to raise more troops to or any raise any troops basically to attack us while raiding, which is a pain in the ass. So, uh, the part of Disher Germany, I think I will be going for a conquest of that as well. And you are allied with the Lendians. You have 666, you're the devil, so why not? I will take your stuff. So we might want to raise the remainder of the boats. And we're not <laughs> really allowing ourselves to reset their vessels race too long, opinion negative to us, but it's not really that big of a deal. It's more important that we conquer land to gain be stronger. So, um, oh shit, uh, I should remove those. And our boats are there, so we will just send our levies or our retinue to raid while our men are readying up for war. So, you guys will not charge over the river, which is a bad, bad idea. Embark. Ourselves and to here, and uh, checking my vassal strength. I think we. Uh, where is the. Yeah, the Yard of Mercia. Gained up quite a bit of troops from him. I just realized. And we have to wait for those guys to. 
replenish even more. Uh, there are four units, so we will have 2,000 troops. So, it will be going nicely. And these troops are ready to raid. No, thank you. Sorry. 2,000, and we will claim your province. Let's get to it. So, um, yeah, I think I will be close to ending the episode soon. I will allow these wars to end, but after that, we will have to call it a day. So, uh, yeah, uh, the greatest problem now, I'll not be content, is uh, how I will be able to claim this kingdom if the king dies no he so for some reason she is the heir to Oslane Oslane and Spithiot so if, if he dies now before having a son which she will then we may have to fight an even stronger, bigger enemy. Which is okay, but I would really love to avoid that. But, oh, what the hell? My child shows every sign of being infatuated with the courtier and follows the person in question everywhere. Maybe it will pass. How sweet, so... I don't really know what that was about, but okay. I'll just allow it to happen. And uh, still waiting for those guys to become strong enough. And then just keep on raiding. This guy is soon going to cede his territory to us. Another son of age. He's not married to anyone, so I'll just focus on finding a person with the trait we want and yeah we will take the 10 year old with the quick why not thank you we'll do nicely and we create the Duchy of Brandenburg now we are holding one Duchy too much which we will have to grant to one of our sons maybe I would really I will abstain from doing that however we don't really have many to choose from, so I will just invite some holy men, spending our piety, not our cash. Just a crap load of those. And wow, we have a genius. Welcome, you will be the Jarl of Brandenburg. Congratulations. And my Drut City. And, no, can't be Herdman. Or Hidden Mom. Um, but yeah, gained your land. Me just send those guys up there. Grant that to some randoms. Maybe I want to fight actually to gain more war score with these guys. And just in time, uh, assigning someone on the left flank. The son came of age. beat the army of Pomerania and again so we will focus on sieging which is nice to have that war score just checking in on the raiders they are old enough or not old enough they are strong enough soon yeah to raid two soldiers stronger than the top holder of the pope and we gained a Casus Belly. She became he became Gregarious, which is nice. So now we can begin going to war with our fellow Norsemen. So I will just accept that. So we will just Yeah, I will think and we'll call it a day now. 
So thank you for watching. I would uh, love it if you left a like and maybe a comment. And I will uh, see you uh, next time. Uh, bye bye.